How's it going, you guys? My name is Cooper Greenberg here with the Alamo Music Center in San Antonio, Texas. You can find us on our website at alamomusic.com. Today we're back with the second installment of our Tone Profile series. Before we did the Stratocaster, and today it's the Telecaster. Uh, we'll post a little link to the previous one below. But, um, you know, today we, we decided to go with the Telecaster because after the Strat, I mean, I can't think of any, any better choice for just classic electric guitar, Fender. Um, and it's a very simple setup here, but I think you'll find that even though it's simple, it's a very versatile guitar. Um, I'm playing on a Made in Japan Fender Daybreak Limited Edition Telecaster. And while it is limited edition, it does have all the ingredients of just a classic Tele. It's got two single coils, um, master volume, master tone, three-way switch. Um, it's got the three saddle bridge here. You might, you might have a Tele with a six saddle bridge, but I really like the three saddle. And, um, you know, we're just working our way through the pickups today. Fender has, from the very beginning, in the Broadcaster or the Esquire, um, it started off with just one single coil in the bridge, and then when the Tele came to be, they added one more um, up in the neck position. But you might associate this guitar with blues, country, very twangy stuff, but I think you'll find as we start working our way through the pickups that um, it can work in a lot of different settings. Um, you know, you get some more full, warm R&B kind of tones from the neck and then just work your way through a lot of rock and roll classics. Um, so let's take a look. I'm playing through a Fender Hot Rod Deluxe today. Got the treble, bass, and middle right at about 12 o'clock with just a little bit of reverb. And as always, got a Mogami cable going through to get the clear signal. So we're gonna start off here at the neck pickup. Like I said, um, very warm, rounded tone. Um, works great in blues and R&B, but uh, yeah. Let's check it out. All right, next off, we're gonna put the switch right in the middle. Um, this is both pickups, the neck and the bridge, and uh, I think you'll see it retains a lot of that warmth from the neck pickup, but you start to bring in that classic twang and the brightness from the bridge pickup. And this tone just really works for everything. You know, you can play rhythm on it, you can play lead. It's gonna cut through, but without being too shrill. <laughs> Now finally we're getting down to the bridge pickup. This is that classic telly tone that everybody knows. Very twangy, very high, um, high treble. Great for country, great for bluegrass leads, but um, you know, it works for everything. Thank you. 
Now finally, since it's very simple setup here, we got three-way switch, worked our way through all three. I just feel like um, it's worth it to put a little overdrive on this thing and, and see how it can handle maybe some more hard rock stuff, some high gain, um, heavy leads, because again, this isn't just a country guitar, it's not just a blues guitar. Um, you know, you can see players spanning every genre playing this thing. Um, so let's jam out with a little bit of overdrive and see how it sounds. <laughs> So there you have it, um, very simple, very basic overview of the very surface, what you can get out of Tele. Um, you might see some other Tele's out there that have a humbucker. You might see an S1 switch or a middle pickup added in. This by no means covers everything that the te Telecaster um, has to offer or everything that Fender has done with the Telecaster. But I think it's really important as always to just know the very basics. So if you're thinking about getting into electric guitar, you might have heard something today that's just the tone that you've been looking for. Or if not, if you've been a strap player for your whole life and always thought that the telly was not for you, I think uh, you can find something for anybody on this guitar. And we'd love to hear what you think. If you're a strap person, if you're a telly person, if you have some sort of modification that you love on a telly, or um, you know, if there's any other guitar that you'd like to see a tone profile for, we got some new stuff coming through. We're gonna be working through Jazzmaster and Jaguar, but just moving outside of Fender as well with other manufacturers and uh, really excited to get to the basics of each of these guitars because every single one has a little something different to offer. Um, thank you very much for watching today. If you can, like and subscribe, turn on your notifications and comment below and tell us what you thought. My name is Cooper Greenberg, thank you very much. Thank you.